Assalamu alaikum everyone. Alhamdulillah, every once in a while we have a great opportunity to meet new people and new Muslims. Today, alhamdulillah, we have a brother from Egypt, his name is Fadi, and he is uh, he's about to embark on a new journey, the journey of Islam. Uh, inshallah, we'll, what we'll do, we'll, we'll uh, hear the testimony, the shahada. Can you all hear me? Yeah. We'll hear the testimony. I'll, I'll say it in Arabic. And Brother Fadi will repeat it after me. I'll, we'll also do it in English because we usually do it in most languages. You know? And uh, it's very simple to, you know, to become Muslim is very simple. Yeah, uh, I mean, saying that in our heart, we start believing in Allah Subhanahu wa Taala as the only Creator. We believe in the Prophet as the final messenger, and uh, we believe in all the prophets from. Adam alayhi salam until Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam. So yeah, so I'll do it slowly as we usually do. But yeah, Ashhadu, Ashhadu, Allah, Allah, Ilaha, Ilaha, Illallah, Illallah. Wa Ashhadu, Wa Ashhadu, Anna, Anna, Muhammadan, Muhammadan, Abduhu wa Rasuluh, Abduhu wa Rasuluh. I bear witness, I bear witness that there is no deity save Allah. That there is no deity except Allah. Mm. I bear witness, I bear witness that there is no deity worthy of worship except Allah. Worthy of worship except Allah. And I bear witness, I bear witness that Muhammad, Muhammad is his final messenger. That Muhammad is his final messenger and his final prophet. And his final prophet to humanity until the day of judgment. To humanity till the day of judgment. Alhamdulillah. Okay. So yeah, so uh, uh, there was there, there was a request for Brother Fadi to introduce himself and uh, to the community, and the community is welcoming. And, uh, so I'm a Coptic Christian from Egypt. Uh, I moved here when I was I moved here in 2013. Uh, I've been a Coptic Christian my whole life. My friend over here, the East, is the one that um, kind of opened up my eyes and made me. Uh, read the scripture and read the Bible, read it all the way through, and uh, found lots of contradictions, found lots of things that just didn't settle with me. And then I also read the Quran, I'm like four chapters in, not really that. But it's making a lot of sense and make, making a lot of sense in my head. And uh, the oneness of God, of the Trinity, and the whole thing is that really the, the thing that kind of. Just put it in song for me. Thank you for bringing your light to us and the privilege of allowing you to be part of this journey. It's a long journey that we're all on, and Shafala, thank you for helping us uh, facilitate this. We have a little gift for you here. It's uh, what the resources that we need for you, for, well, that we feel that would help you hit the ground running with this, inshallah. And uh, and we believe what our Prophet also said, that um, when you take your shahada, all any wrong that you've done, I just told a very beautiful presence, you don't have much, but anything like that has been wiped clean. But you keep all your good deeds, inshallah. Now, may Allah bless you. You're going to have a lot of brothers that, uh, that will welcome you to the faith. Uh, they'll ask for your prayers because we have a lot to answer for and uh, you don't. So that's why your prayers are very valuable. So we ask for you to pray for all of us, inshallah. May Allah bless you. You're part of this community. Welcome. So I just want to say, mention one thing. So yeah, we have reported that whenever someone becomes Muslim, all his previous sins are wiped out. But we also have reports that say if someone becomes Muslim, their previous good deeds will be counted for them. 